to make these we need beautiful photos so i will be downloading jpg files okay now i downloaded everything i need to convert these photos here i have photos i need to convert these photos into ascii art yeah ascii art means the photos will be in the form of characters like this these are all the characters ascii characters now i need to convert these into ascii art these photos so to convert that we will be going with the websites online websites google just convert image to ascii art minitools.org we can google it convert images to ascii art now we are we have a link many tools okay, and this is the same link now i'll be choosing the photo desktop java art tada krishna one okay. i have chosen it so uh, invert the black background invert convert now we have white moon okay this is the output we need so we can control all and copy oh, this is not possible to control all it will not work just download ascii txt file format now we need to read every character in this file and we need to print that in the output so we will be writing one java application new okay Okay, go with artist. Okay, we need Java, right? Dot Java. Open type. Okay, open it in Notepad plus plus. Artist. We have created a class, and we have to create one main public static void main string args. Okay, their argument. So, let's see. Now we need to read that file. To read that, we can use file in string. This is available in the Java. Sorry, import Java dot. Or dot star. then f in okay create an object for a file input string to create object new then file input string only for the file input string we need to pass one path the path is same as up to this path the path is same to get that one i am using system property system dot get property then give the property name what is the property user dot dir okay we will test this one first we will, we will check this one system dot out dot and then okay first we will print this one to verify whether it's working or not same this not writing my system so okay java c artist dot java okay illegal why oh, we have to put three three dots there okay for where where are three dots no or we can use array there okay for interesting is not applicable we are passing an argument right so we need to pass this one just create one path i am just providing one string path later we will store the path full path from this from this uh, we will get up to java path then after that uh, we will give file file name let's just uh, try this one java c artist java unreported exception file not found exception we have to throw that throws this one file not found exception
exception in thread 504 exception at your method so okay this is working actually we have not passed any file correct path so it's a throwing error but we are also printing this one but we are not getting this one system dot get property we have to get this one actually but we are not getting i don't know why java c java test okay ah uh, well, actually this is the path we have got yeah this path up to this we are getting so after that we have to provide one slash after that file name up to this we are getting the path so we have to provide file name after that only so append this one cut and uh, provide here the file path the file type will be dot txt right character sasci character this is the character file we have and we need to cut this and paste this in our where is that java art provide whatever the name you want i have to provide the same pick name java so okay then we, we need to provide this file name here so we will be creating one generic method here. I need to take input from the command. So I will be using this args only. String file name is equal to yeah, yes. Let's short this one. A yeah, yeah, of zero. So get this name. To this append one backward slash two. then the file name this is the variable so we need to provide like this like this after that the file extension dot txt now let's check this one here yeah. java c artist java k okay, we will provide radha krishna one this okay we are not printing that one right just we are providing the path system dot out dot print till end print the full path okay to avoid the confusion just adding the text description then java test rather krishna one sorry we have to compare again provide the same okay now we got the full path i need to provide this path to the File input, file input string. No, we know there's no need of printing this. File input string f in is equal to new file input string path. After this, just provide one while loop, create intertype container value or say v is equal to f in dot read reading the file if v is not equal to minus one continue reading print this one system dot out dot print so we need to don't cache this to care this will be the type of in so we are don't casting it to care now update the v value f in dot read so we need to provide one thread here thread dot slip with one microsecond and it should uh, throws interrupted exception let's test this one cls clear java c artist IO exception must be caught or declared to be thrown if in dot read okay must be caught so we need to throw IO exception also so remove this one provide IO exception that's it so we are getting the output here hey hey hey, hey. this one taking something else in which location we have created this Okay, we ran this one only, but it's taking that away. Okay, maybe we are copied wrong file. Let's download this one. Maybe we have downloaded it. Control J. Okay, we need to 
copy this one okay cut this desktop java art rename this file name by this name copy paste now we will rerun the same program just to clear the screen java c java artist now we have the output if you don't want this much of time to make the, this much of delay you can just remove the red dot slip uh, you just don't provide red dot slip here it will make the things quicker easier okay commented it let's run this again okay we'll make some settings also retro type just to see how it will look command line appearance there is retro okay retro terminal effect save Java C artist to clear this one fully. CLS Java C artist compile Java artist for the Krishna run. Now we have the output here. The desired output. This is our desired output. So if we have this file, now we have this file, we can reuse the same file for printing other characters also. Let's do that. Just test how it will work. I'm choosing another file. Just I will choose a Shiva. This one only. Okay, we will just uh, pick it, this one. We need only this part. Right. Okay. Shiva. In what? Black. Now I have the text file here, yeah. just taking the text file, after downloading, just copy that, take this one, folder, open the folder, then just cut, cut it and paste it to the place where we have our program, we have the, our program in this folder, so I am pasting it here, now Shiva, file name. Then I will go to the same program here again. Just close all our background things. Everything. Close this one also, this one also, this one also. Okay. Don't need this. Okay. So, Java artist, not Radha Krishna. Now I want to print Shiva. Now we have the output, proper output here. Shiva. To make things simple, you can use the IDE also to write this code. Just you need to create one path. You can also provide the path like this also. Okay, just you can copy this here. Instead of this one, you can also provide like this. If this is the path variable you are giving, just put double code and paste the path copied from your system. Then after that, uh, here you need to provide two slashes, two backward slashes. Then in, in this folder, whatever the file name you need to give, you can provide that. You can provide the same. Uh, uh, implement this one after this, after here, like this. Copy and paste. That's it. You can do the same thing. But I prefer this one uh, because it's a dynamic. Uh, you can copy this file, the whole file, wherever you want and do the task. Okay. Just throw, ex ex uh, throw or handle the exception. Just read it and print it. If you want to delay, you can delay by using a thread dot slip, or else it's fine. If you don't use thread dot slip, this interrupted exception is not required. But to read and writing, we need IO exception to throw here. With should throw IO exception, you can just use other text files also. Okay, now if we have multiple files, okay, I have another file also here. I will just write that one also here. Okay, just minimize it. 
Java. File name, provide the file name. I'm just providing the file name only. Click on enter. That's it. Repeat the same task. If this is not good, I'm repeating the same command. It will print again. That's it. Like this, you can convert the images to ASCII art and you can print using a Java program on the CMD. Command line prompt. 